Oh, hey kids. Didn't see you there. <laughs> Welcome to a weird background, I know. These are my makeup shelves. I would like to tell you a really cool reason as to why I'm in here, but the truth of the matter is the rest of my studio is just destroyed. This was the only background that was available. So I posted on my Instagram story yesterday, I think it was, or two days ago. Yeah, it was two days ago. And I asked if you guys still liked haul videos and if you wanted me to haul everything I got from Target. <clears throat> I mean Target. <laughs> And then I realized, okay, I have a hair stuck to me. I realized it was a dumb question because the last haul I did, the Yes Style one, I'm pretty sure it just hit a million views on Facebook. <laughs> you guys like hauls. I get it. So here we go. I have several bags here. I bought a lot of stuff, mostly home decor and clothes. Clothes. What a fun word. So if you want to see what I got from Target, just keep watching. Oh, the first thing I got isn't even for me. It was for Remy. It is the cutest little tie-dye set. A sweaty shirt and shorts. By the way, Remy's not my daughter. Remy and Adler are not my kids. I know you guys always think they're my kids and I am happy to claim them, but I don't have any kids. But sometimes I like to live vicariously through parents and buy kid clothes and toys because I find it fun. So the other day when I was there, I was so impressed with all of the uh, like workout clothes I was finding. It really looked like they were stepping up their game. So I got this tank. Look at her. It's so beautiful. It's like a sea mint. I don't know what you would call this color, but there's something about these holes that just do it for me. I'm all about the cropped length. I probably always will be. I just wear it with high-waisted leggings, so I'm not like showing the whole fupa. There's a built-in bra, and I like that the pads are removable because I don't need the pads, you know? By the way, I did not fart. That's this chair. Oh, also I got the same exact tank top in black. <gasps> I wanna put this on right now. Would that be weird? That would be weird. It just looks so good. Got another tank, like a peach tie-dye tank. It reminded me of 1997 and I liked it. I got two pairs of joggers. One of them I already wore and like got stains on immediately and they're in another room. And then I got these joggers too. These were on clearance. The All In Motion brands got side pockets and adjustable waistband. And I don't know what you call this print, but I think it's really cute and it looks real soft. This and the other pair I got are my first joggers. I know I'm super late. They became in style like two years ago or maybe more. I just held on to the leggings for a long time. Hey. I forgot I wanted to take these braids out. I forgot. Hold on. If your hair was in French braids for 24 hours and it's still damp when you're taking the braids out and you're really upset because it's not gonna be as cute as you had hoped, clap your hands. It doesn't look how I hoped. Are these gonna stay separated? <sighs> oh, uh, oh, I'm sorry. <clears throat> what was that? I, I can't hear you through my beautiful hair. This, okay, this is Instagram worthy. I'm sorry. We interrupt your regularly scheduled programming to boomerang this hair. Now back to the show. Okay, these were so cute. The brand is Parker Lane and it's a set of six reusable party cups. Technically these are for a party, but again, I have kids at my house all the time and I'm obsessed with buying them cups. So these say sip, sip, hooray. Sip, sip, hooray, which is really cute. All right, getting into the home decor. So as you guys know, we recently created a whole new bathroom. We had this weird little like spare bedroom in my house that wasn't really a spare bedroom. It was like one big bedroom that someone stuck a wall in. So there was was this awkward sized room attached to my bedroom and we turned it into a bathroom. So now it's time to like decorate it and furnish it and stuff. So I got these hair jars. These are for like cotton balls, Q-tips. Personally for me, I actually don't use cotton balls. I use cotton pads. Do you? Oh my gosh, yes, okay. I got two of these Casa Luna, is that how you say it? Casa Luna towels. Okay, this is the cotton modal bath towel. Oh my gosh, these were 15 bucks, which might be the most I've ever spent on a towel. I never cared about towels before, but as I get older, I need literally everything to be soft. And normally I feel like really soft towels are like $40 <laughs> or something stupid. There was only two left or else I would have bought like 10 of them because oh my gosh, the other one is in my bathroom already and I had an experience when I got out of the shower and used it. Towel so soft, you ain't had nothing soft. I got a vanity organizer by Threshold. I thought it was cool because it has these little hinges and it like lifts up, you know? And in the photo, it looks like it would fit a lot of stuff. I'm thinking like a lot of wood accents in there as you'll find out. These are pretty boring. These are just room essentials washcloth. I have that little wooden tub caddy I got from Amazon and I thought it would be really cute to have like little ones of these rolled up. Cause you have to have a way to kind of dry off your hands while you're playing with your phone in the bathtub. <laughs> 
Target. Got this tapered candle holder set. These are not for the bathroom, or maybe they could be for the bathroom, I don't know. I got that new touch thing in my dining room, and I haven't put anything on top of it yet, and I think this looks so cool and like tiny and little bit gothic, but not. I'm gonna put flameless pillar candles in here, maybe even color changing ones, I don't know. Oh, I got a bunch of jewelry. I'm not an expensive jewelry type of gal because um, I will lose it almost 100% of the time. <laughs> not right away, like eventually. Like I'll keep, I'll hold on to something for a good several months and then I'll lose it. So I like this salad gold bar necklace salad. This salad gold bar. Cute, 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 cute. Got these. This is just like a marble stone on the end of it. And it, oh, it's a semi-precious turquoise. Oh. I'm into the layered necklaces on over like a crew neck top. I never was before, but one day I was like watching myself in a video and I had on a crew neck sweatshirt and I was like, you need something going on right here, girl. I'm looking over at the area where I filmed the video because that's what I see in my mind's eye. <laughs> More layering, but this time in gold. This universal, ooh, I really like the little stone at the end of this one. Isn't she cute? Gosh. And then I got some just basic pearl earrings. I love a good white ball in my earlobe for spring and summer. In fact, Nick got me the um, gift card to go get my ears pierced more for our 10 year anniversary, which was in December. And I still haven't had a chance to go do it. But also I'm a little scared. Last thing I got for the bathroom is this hooded trash can. I believe this is the Threshold brand. I don't remember, but I'll make sure I link everything below. I like these little notches and it's just so cute, right? Don't disagree. <laughs> and the last thing I went and grabbed are those other joggers I got. Let me put them right side in. Here they are. And as you can see, I got Indian cauliflower stew on them right there. And then I got something else on them when I was in Nick's truck. But I got a size 2X as I do with pretty much everything. And again, this is the all in motion brand. These ones fit weird. I love the wide band, like the wide waistband. I felt like the waist was too big and the ankle hole was too big. Like it was like floating around my ankle and then the thigh part was too tight. Uh, it could just be me. I have pretty big thighs, but most things don't fit that weird on me. So I don't know. I'll see what happens after I wash them. So that's it for me kids. This is going to be like the shortest video ever. I feel like I've been filming for like five seconds and I have to say it was incredibly easy and incredibly fun. So let me know if you want more hauls because I'm always buying stuff these days. Me and my hair will see you in the next video. Bye. <laughs> I'm sorry. Hey, it's me, Jamie, featuring pneumonia. I'm about to upload the video that you're watching right now, um, but I realized I didn't tell you what I put in my hair to make it look like that. So I put this in it, and then I French braided it, and then I let it dry for 24 hours, literally. Why am I here? Bounce Me Curl Bomb by Design.me. I'll link it in the description. I may be dying inside and kind of drowning, but I have cute hair. <laughs> what could I grab for the thumbnail? If you've got saggy boobs and terrible hair. Have you seen that TikTok? <laughs> I don't have terrible hair anymore, but I can relate to everything else, you know? Girls and boys, I just discovered the most amazing hair technique and I can't wait to teach it to you.